Welcome back to Cult of the Lamb. It's time for others to sleep as we pick out our next upgrade. And we're getting to the point where our economy is pretty well sustaining itself. So at this point, I'm almost more interested in finding upgrades that are really going to help us um, with our combat ability. And so, because of that reason, I've been thinking about this whole uh, demon summoning circle over here. Where is it? Uh, yeah, demonic summoning circle. That sounds like that could be interesting. But first, we need to take missionary to make that happen. Uh, we send followers to go gather resources. That sounds like a neat way to maybe make some extra coin. So that will be sort of next on our uh, desired list. And uh, unfortunately, we have had a couple people die, unfortunately. So we're going to need to uh, do a little bit of maintenance around here. And there's my spouse, Patroclus. <laughs> All right. So Iphigenia is in there. Let's do some re-education, and we might be able to get Hector back to uh, a normal frame of mind. It's hard to tell if they're if they're being chill or if they still need some uh, extra education. But anyway, we have indeed fully filled up our uh, grave. So let's go ahead and make a few more of these, just so that we are prepared for the worst. And keep in mind, we also do have Resurrection available uh, if that becomes something that we want to do in the future. So we'll create these pits. Oh, we're going to get some uh, some goodies from them. There we go. We will go ahead and do everything that we normally do in, our, uh, in the church when everybody wakes up. They're almost at the end of their fast, so we will have to be prepared to to make some uh, some food. Oh, can't quite get that. These are so fun to, to try to, to to capture. All right. So Hector, let's go ahead and re-educate, and then we should be able to release them. There we go. They're good to go. All right, we can go ahead and release you now. Enjoy, my friend. All right, let's go ahead. They're doing their morning prayers. Let's go ahead and uh, do some inspiration. <laughs> uh, that's one of my favorite parts of the day is doing the little, the little dance. Okay. Awesome. So, um, Patroclus has reached old age, which means we should do something about that to capitalize on their death. Um, everybody gains loyalty. Hmm. The thing is, we don't really need any loyalty right now, because we're, 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 we're pretty full. But let's go ahead and do Sermon anyway. Yeah, we've got some old folks that we need to be replacing. And Doctrine, what do we want to do? Uh, whoops, that's not what I wanted to do. Here we go. Oh, it's just still on a little bit of a cooldown, okay. Collect a few of those. Thank you so much. Oh, donation uh, is something else we should also think about. Let's just try that for for the fun of it and see what what happens. Okay, we got some uh, donations here, so I should go around and do that a little bit more. It seems like. Let's make sure that stuff is staying uh, prepped. Okay. 
So those are going on. And then... Yeah, that's fine. Cool. Oh, look at all this wood. Love it. Our economy is really working well. Can we do a doctrine now? Yes, we sure can. All right. Let's try to keep bringing in the money, if at all possible. So we'll do whatever the... Uh, yeah, value of earthly goods. Uh, when a new building is constructed, gain f plus five faith. Or gain more faith when delivering a sermon. That's not exactly... Neither of those were exactly what I was hoping for. But... Um, we'll do the sermon, I guess. That's fine. Since we do that daily anyway, we like we may as well, right? Okay, uh, that's all. Let's go ahead and bring in our new member. Hang on a second while I pull up their name. Okay, so who are you going to be? Uh, you are going to be Orion, the hunter. Just ironic, because you're a duck. Get it? Duck hunter? Anyway. That might be a little bit of a long bow to draw. Uh, refined materials, sure. Alright, what's up, Arachne? Uh, okay, so people who are going to have low faith... Yes, we'll, we'll just re-educate them right away. That's that's fine. All right, another duck. Uh, we will call you Atalanta. And we will put you in prison uh, right away. Because you are a heretic. Yes, goodbye. Okay. We're in a good spot at the moment. Uh, let's go ahead and get another run in. So, we are not over there. You're in Anchor Deep. All right, Vampiric Hammer, sure thing. And Death Sweep, interesting. All right, I've got to I've got to watch out for this because it's got a very uh, a very slow trigger. All right, we'll take that relic. Sure, why not? Good for us. Ooh, gotta watch out for these guys. Let's go ahead and drop one of those. There we are. They're gonna they're gonna explode. Nice. Oh, I forgot we got to do a heavy attack on them. Guy's okay, stuck. Man. Alright, I... Not doing too well on this run, just because I think the attack trigger is uh, allowing them to get more of an attack off than I can muster at the moment, unfortunately. Yeah, not great. Uh, that's just not a good weapon for us, just with our specific playstyle. But that's fine. I mean, at at the very least, we uh, we knew pretty close to the beginning that it was not going to be the move, so we could get another one going in short order.
No worries. What do we have here? Uh, yeah. Oh, this is a new one. The the ghost. I think this is this is new to us. That was not ideal. Okay. Good stuff. Ooh, this is a new one. Freeze all active enemies. Sure. Nice. Alright, I like my mobility a lot more this time. Nice. Let's go ahead and drop a bunch of these curses. They're gonna keep summoning if I'm not careful. Don't know if I hit him there. There we are. Okay. A lot more comfortable this time. Much, much more comfortable. Um, okay. Nice. Got him out in short order. Ah, uh, shoot. Waited a little too long on that one. Okay. Pick up a sneaky card for us. More fervor. Beautiful. Ooh, this one. Risk reward, huh? Sure. I'm up for it. I, I wonder what the rates are, because we've had one success, one failure. Oh, okay. An abundance of food. Sure. And we may as well take their money. I'm sure if you try to talk to them after this, they're going to be uh, upset. Man, everybody's reaching old age right now. Yeah, he's a little salty right now. Alright, but we're not uh, going to stick around to find out what he would do to us. This is a pretty good, uh, curse, all things considered. Uh oh. Uh, I couldn't roll away quick enough. Alright. Not bad. Okay. I do want to backtrack and see if there is a tarot card that we missed. I'm sure there must be. Yeah. I'm gonna go with uh, poison damage, I think. Yeah. Cool. Those damage over time effects are actually pretty helpful. Especially on a quicker weapon like this, where you may only be able to get one or two hits on an enemy anyway, and then have to retreat. Let's get more followers. Our population's getting old, so... You know. Here we go. Try to line them up if we can. Nice. Let's do it again. They're dropping two, two times more fervor, so we should feel free to uh, to do this a lot.
Good job. On us. Yes. Beautiful. Is that it? Oh, he's still down there. Okay. Ah, oh, shoot. Come on, man. Oh, we're still not done. Wow. Finally, okay. Let's see if we can get some uh, healing here. I wouldn't mind that. Alright, why don't you come work for me? Getting dangerously close to that summoning circle, which will be nice. Ooh, this is new. This these uh little towers here. All right, I think he's gonna die from the flame anyway. Yeah, there we go. Oh, Patroclus has uh, left, and Pollux is dissenting. Man, things are not great. Uh, I'll do Divine Guardian. That's fine. Recycle this one. Alright, stuff is going down at the back at the ranch, so we need to get back there. Alright. Mm, which way next? Over here, I guess. Oh shoot. Okay. Oh, there's our first heal of the uh of the day. Alright, let's hope we can get something beneficial over here. Oh yeah, this guy is the worst. Can I use it to hit himself? Is that possible? Gosh, I have no idea what I'm supposed to do there. Yeah, I have no idea how this guy's supposed to who's supposed to be taken care of. Man, that sucks. So here's the thing. Uh, I want to I want to keep this moving right along. So why don't I just sort of get you to the point where we are encountering the boss? How's that? And we'll go from there. Okay, so we're actually going to go ahead and knock out some business here first. Just because things are not good. They're not good at all. Alright, this guy, first of all, needs to be a little bit re-educated. That's a start. Um, Alright, how is this guy doing here? They are... Still in a bad spot. We need to build a second prison, I guess, just in case we get two concurring dissenters. Uh, boy. Boy, oh boy. Where is the prison? There we go. Second prison here. Okay. I need folks to come over here and uh, do this for me. The thing is that Pollux is uh, has a moon necklace, so they're 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 going around and doing things all day. And I've really neglected my farms as well. It's kind of unfortunate, but it has been pretty nice to not worry about followers, uh, you know, 
having to uh, go hungry. So you're going to be in prison too. Here we go. Price is subverted. Prepare for burial. I'll pick you up. I feel like if everybody's asleep, it should be okay if I loot them, but... Faith is already low. I may as well take it, right? Okay. Oh, okay. That's good. And put you in there. Okay, so we need to get some faith stuff uh, going here. Uh, we have, like, almost no seeds, which is bad. Bad, bad, bad. There's some... Okay. First things first, everybody in the church. Uh, at this point, we definitely want to do a ritual to ascend somebody. Um, what can we do there? Ascend follower. Oh, actually, you know, first let's go ahead and collect uh, the faith from everybody, since they're going to contribute to us, and they're gonna they're gonna receive extra faith from the sermon. A little extra faith. All right, that's actually pretty good. And declare a doctrine. Uh, sure, sustenance. Um, causes all your seeds to be immediately ready for harvest, or the ocean's bounty. I can't really see myself be wanting to to do either of these. I guess the harvest one sounds more useful overall. Not bad. Uh, let's step outside briefly because I do want to harvest the devotion from these guys before I uh, ascend them. Okay. All right. And then Arachne. We're going to get uh, a little bit of a faith boost for completing a quest. Let's go ahead and do that. And we'll get some tithes. There we go. Alright, I think we're in a position... Actually, let's bring in this new uh, follower as well. You'll be Jason... The Argonaut. Oh. Jason the Argo. Close enough. I can't believe we haven't had a Jason up to this point, you know? Alright. Um, ten farms, I guess. Alright, I'm gonna hopefully my, my followers will come and uh, take care of the rest of this. Alright, so now at this point we can go ahead and ascend people. Ascend somebody. Do that. To one of our old folks. Whoever's the older of the two is what we'll do. That, uh, yeah, caster. Getting a little bit light on followers, so we're going to still prioritize picking those up wherever we can. Okay. Uh, so with that... We're in a decent spot. Let's go ahead and repair the stuff around here. Not that we need to worry, because <laughs> we don't have the followers to... To, uh, to go into all of these. 
Uh, we can go ahead and cook quite a few meals. Actually, here these out. Party meat, meat broth. Fish. Yeah, one fish. Okay. I think we have another point to pick up. Yes, we do. Demonic Summoning Circle. So, uh, possess them with the spirit of a demon so they can join me. That sounds interesting. And that might be another good use for the old folks. Uh, you know what I mean? Uh, because I assume that means they get like... Um, they get totally transformed. Okay, Atalanta is good to go. That's good, so we can go ahead and release them. Alright, go forth and do good things. We'll re-educate you. Good, alright, we are actually in a really good spot right now. Let's try to get you... with all of these blessings. Arachne is leveling up. I don't know why, it's always so satisfying, that animation. Okay. We... I guess we'll just put whatever seeds we have left in here. Now, I, I thought my followers were supposed to come over here and... do farming stuff. Maybe... Maybe I'm mistaken. Um... Ganymede, why don't you go and do farm stuff? Okay, uh, so while I finish these sort of maintenance tasks around here, I'm gonna go and step away because I think that we're okay for the moment. Uh, you kind of get the idea of what we're doing, and then once we get to the boss, the next level of the uh, the underwater plane, then I will bring you back. So I will see you in a minute. Okay, I think we are ready. We are rocking a super duper heavy duty hammer. Very, very slow, but very, very powerful as well. We don't have a relic, unfortunately. That's, that kind of sucks, but you know, what are you gonna do? All right, well. Not an amazing start. Dealing a pretty good chunk of damage, I will say. Yeah, the thing is, it's so slow. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, okay. So the slow weapons are just not my thing, I think. Unfortunate, but that's just the way it is. Okay, so I did want to come back here briefly, actually, uh, for two things. First of all, to level up uh, in our divine inspiration. Uh, and then second of all, to test out this demonic summoning circle. So why don't we take a look at this real quick before we go too much further. Automatically collect dropped further is pretty nice. More starting hearts. More explosion damage, better health drops. Flies away and returns with red hearts. That seems pretty nice. More damage dealt. Hmm. Automatically collecting dropped further could be nice. Um Interesting. So they're gonna be they're gonna be like gone to me permanently, right? Basically, is that what it is? 
Uh, Arachne, I think that you're actually best served as a demon who heals me. <laughs> so I just want to, I want to see what that looks like. Interesting. Okay, so they're available to me now. Uh, we'll go ahead and bring these guys in while we're at it. You'll be Andromeda. Okay. Uh, you can go do farm stuff. We collected a couple followers on the way, which is nice. You'll be Asclepius. Oops. Here we go. And you, I don't really care what you do. I guess, I guess worship for now. Oh, yeah, and we're supposed to make Heracles eat a bowl of poop. <laughs> There's that. So, where is it? Bowl of poop. Where'd, where'd Heracles go? Oh, there he is. Oh, good, he automatically goes and eats it. <laughs> Yeah, I know, I know. I know. <laughs> uh, yeah, Heracles, why don't you go to bed rest? <laughs> there we go. Oh, I feel bad. It is pretty funny, though. A collect a reward from Arachne. Oh, no, but she's the one that we converted, so... We may not get the award. Uh, award. So what does is, what is this what nun do? Uh, summon two demons at a time. That seems kind of nice. As long as we're getting like a good um, like number of followers summoned along the way, you know, then that might be okay. All right. We desperately need some faith management here. We should go check on our prisoners too. Uh-oh, he's dissenting. I did not realize that. Okay, what else can we do? We're getting near the end of um of uh these up these upgrade paths. Gain 20 faith when brainwashing is performed or Increase work speed and devotion. Regeneration. Uh, but 50%. Okay. Well, that's fine. I am not planning on using brainwashing all that much. I'd rather just have the passive generation, uh, devotion generation, I guess. Okay. Orpheus is not happy with us. All right, where is he? There he is. All right, into prison for you. Do I have anybody in prison? I do. Need to re-educate them. Oh, so close to being normal again. And by normal, I mean under my control. <laughs> All right, good, 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 good. Uh-oh. Hector has died. Oh, dear. Well. He will be long remembered. Uh, I am going to take the loot. Even though people do not like it. I think it's only fair. And let's... Do some gifting. We have quite a few of these. Give one to you. Um, I've already given a gift, apparently. 
You're new. I'll give one to you as well. Uh, sure. Feather necklace. Atalanta is new. Pretty good progress. Andromeda, I think we need to give a gift to. Um, we'll keep you up overnight. How about that? I like the cut of your jib. Okay. Oh, people are not consecrating for whatever reason. So... You go refine materials, and you go refine materials. I guess I need to put some in there, huh? And same thing for this one. And then I should also... Oh, add gold bars, sure. There we go. I guess I should make another lumber yard. One at it. Here we are. Anything else that I can build that I haven't built yet? Oh, Sermon uh, Circle 2. Yeah, I can just upgrade upgrade this, right? Okay. Arachne is no longer a demon. Oh, interesting. So she only stays it for a certain amount of time. I did not realize that was the case. Yes, I am hilarious. This is true. Alright, let's cook up some food. Quite a few things to cook here. And then we should go put some more seeds in. Okay, that's good. Okay, so while they're doing that, I feel pretty comfortable about going... Um... Well, actually, hang on. Oh, they didn't even finish building this. That's kind of unfortunate. Because I do want to take a demon with me, if at all possible. And Arachne is probably... the, uh, the best candidate for doing that. Almost there. If we could take two with us, will be, which will be interesting. And I guess the advantage is that they're not going to get hungry, right? Alright, we'll do her. And we'll do... What else would be good? Shoot a projectile. Sure. Automatically collect drop further fervor seems nice. Alright, I've got two of y'alls. Uh how do I get you to come with me? Will you automatically just come with me when I start a crusade? That's my question. I guess we'll see here in a second, huh? Yep, here they are. Okay, good stuff. Let's, uh... Stay together for this initial run. Ooh, Hounds... Or, uh, Cleansing Fire. That's good. Let's just see how this works. Oh, a little far away.
Okay. Not bad so far. We're able to stagger them a little there. That's good. Okay. I'm liking what I'm uh, experiencing so far. This is actually pretty nice. Um, let's take plus one heart. Give us some extra breathing room. Nice. Efficient. Uh-oh. Shoot. Oh, man. This is not good. Not a good start. Let's clean up the, these guys first. Okay. This whole heavy attack thing is really not working for me. What the heck? Okay, there we go, finally. Can't say I really understand. Okay. Yeah, I have no idea how these heavy attacks are supposed to work sometimes. It's kind of frustrating, actually. Okay, so we're back, and I'm feeling pretty good about this one. So I don't exactly understand what happened. Um, we have a bunch of extra demons that spawned. <laughs> I don't know if this is a bug, or if it's something that just happens and I'm just totally missing out on, but, um, we have, we started out with two demons and now we have eight, so try to figure that out. Uh, we're rocking the claws right now and we just picked up the Hounds of Fate, so we should be in a pretty solid position, all things considered, right now, so... Let the Hounds of Fate do their thing. Okay. That's good. Let's just launch these while we have them. Our uh, guided cruise missiles. Very solid. Let's launch this one as well. And there we go. So we definitely got quite a bit of an assist from the game. <laughs> I don't know how or why or, you know, like, do we always get this many demons to spawn? I don't know. Uh, nuggets, lumber, I mean, I feel like more and more we need money. So I'm going to take a bunch of those. We can always, we can always get more lumber. All right. So that is a definite relief. To knock that one out. And uh, I'm really loving the demons. I mean, if, if we do get a new demon every time, then that's like a huge uh, benefit. Or maybe it was just a bug. I don't know. Either way, <laughs> we strongly uh, benefited from it. Definitely some bugginess going on. Uh, what can we make? Bunch of pumpkin soup. Um, I guess we'll have to do some grass just to make ends meet. We should go harvest the berries. We picked up a decent amount of food this past run, so we should be in a good position here. Um, nice, another divine inspiration. Should be in a good position to throw. Oh, maybe not. Okay. Let's go ahead and pick some of the stuff. Uh, let's pick the berries at the very least. And I'll let my followers do the other ones. I just want to make sure that we're getting um, 
the food going as quick as possible. All right. Bunch of mushrooms. Don't really need them, but what can you do? All right. So what is this? Bone decorations? It's just cosmetic, right? Give them faith when admired. Okay. Yeah, I don't know about that. Uh, oh, yeah, right. Of course. We have Colt 4. Which, obviously, we want to do that. So we are at the highest tier now, officially. Oh, guys, you didn't have to wake up for me. But there we go. Bolt upgraded to the highest level. Uh, let's go ahead and bring in our new talent. Alright, who is next? We have... Uh, Ajax the Greater. Whoops. Alright, the Great. Fine. That works for me. Not enough characters. Okay, um, do farm stuff, I guess. Uh, and for you, we'll have you be, uh, Menelaus. Alright, new day. Um, let's check out the situation over here. Very good. Uh, let's keep the wood pipeline going. Ooh, and let's do the gold nuggets as well. Good, good, good. Alright, those things are working well. Uh, why don't we do a new doctrine while we're here? And a sermon, I guess. Alright. We've got a decent number of followers now. I'm, I've been really pushing hard to get as many as possible. Alright, it'll still be a couple days before we get a new level. Alright, I guess we just have one more to go into, huh? Alright, respect your elder's trait. Uh, okay. Gain plus ten... No, that's, that's a little bit of a gamble. I don't want them to lose faith if an elder dies naturally, because sometimes they die when I'm gone. So I'll do this one. Respect your elders. Okay. New doctrine has been declared. Very nice. Let's get as many people blessed as possible. Okay, very good. Uh, who else? Jason. I'm gonna tell him to go sleep. Uh, cause he was with me on my last quest and he has earned it. How are our, uh, do we have any pri- we have no prisoners right now. That's actually kind of a rarity for us. Um, okay. Let's go and do the next, uh, next one I guess. Should I buy a follower? I can afford it. I'm very tempted right now. Um, I'm gonna hold off just for the moment because there's a lot of demands on our on our finances right now. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna try out this resummon thing. It might be a little bit of a waste, but I'm just kind of curious. I'm kind of curious what that does. Oh, resummon, it basically just means, um, to re- like, to give me a new one? Is that what that means? Is that what I had last time? I guess it must be. Oh, I forgot to bring in demons. Well, rip to me. Rip to me. Let's 
you that as well. Nice. Ooh, I don't like that. You guys are tough, man. Okay. Message received. Don't mess around with them. Oh, this is new. Clunko and Bop. Hello, wee lamb. Fancy seeing you somewhere dangerous like this. I'm Clunko. This is Bop. We're off to our friend Ratao's for a night of drinking and dicing. It's going to be quite the party. Ratao and the others know me for going overboard with the betting. Last time I bet and I lost my hand. Talk about overplaying your hand. Haha. <laughs> it was hilarious. I'll win it back though. Say, you should come. You seem tough, rich, and fond of risk. Perfect for knuckle bones. So we've got another opponent. So maybe we should go have like a knuckle bones episode sometime. That would be kind of sick. Just get a little bit of extra cash. Oh, here we go. Your friend Ratel was the last vessel sent against us. The sniveling coward. And there were countless before him, all equally pathetic and unworthy. Nothing humbles quite like disease. I cast a plague upon your cult. Oh no. Guys. Oh, that's, there's going to be so much stuff to clean up. But a couple people love being sick, apparently, so that's good for us, I guess. <laughs> Weirdos. Okay. Ooh, three times more fervor. Yes, please. That is a no-brainer for us. Oh, this guy. Okay, so I figured out the way that you have to deal with this guy is to hit these back at him. And you can't do it consecutively. Or you do, but you have to, like, dodge for the second one. Yeah, okay. Yeah, this guy, so I understand what to do, it's just difficult to make happen. Especially if you're wielding an axe and you don't have a very fast attack uh, animation. So I think we've seen everything new. Oh, well people are sick. Actually, let's go ahead and, and deal with that. So you go rest. You go rest. You... Uh, no, I don't... I, you should sleep. Here we go. You should rest. You should rest. Oops. And you should rest. Okay, I think that's everybody who's sick. On the bright side, that gives us plenty of fertilizer to add in. And we've got nothing really to deposit, unfortunately. Okay. Um, so here's what I'm thinking. We've seen... Um, we've seen that that arrow guy takes a quicker weapon to wield, so I'm wondering if it's worth resummoning to get a quicker weapon. Oh, actually, this is perfect. The Crusader's Blade, not bad. And it should be able to hit them back quick enough. It, it, it's not a big deal. Oh, I forgot demons again. All right, well, we'll try to make that. Uh, and also, uh, I get an extra heart. I keep forgetting if I eat it, like before, uh, before I go out on a run need to get better at remembering these pre-run tasks. Oh, this is a new one. Huh. Okay. Uh, I would rather have him than the than fight the arrow guy a uh, hundred times. Um, mm, attack rate. Yep. I'm. Ge I generally am inclined to take the uh, the upgraded, uh, you know, enhanced cards whenever they're they become available.
All right, not bad. I'm actually gonna go out check out the other room. I might regret it. But uh, in the off chance, there's something valuable. Ooh. What does this do again? Sacrifice health, no. Uh, yeah, uh, well, mm. Should I? You know what, why not? Single red heart, okay, that's fine. And I got weapon damage increase. Okay, that, was that worth it? Mm. I guess it depends how much the damage has been increased. If I'm like one-shotting enemies now, then yeah, absolutely, it's worth it, but... We're a little, uh... We're a little weak. Is there anywhere I can get health along the way? Does not look like it. Uh, food though. We always need more food. So I will gladly take that. Man, harvesting food is always so, like, peaceful. I guess that's the appeal of things like Stardew Valley, right? <laughs> this is your little Stardew Val Valley, uh, portion of the episode. Alright, uh, let's keep getting followers. That's actually very nice. Uh oh, okay. Ah, uh, shoot. There goes our diseased hearts. Still another one. Wow. Okay. Let me get this guy down first. Ah. All right. Keep them coming. Oh yeah, we have to perform the harvest ritual. I keep forgetting those little uh, side quests we have. All right, well, two hearts. Is that going to be enough to get us through boss time? Guess we'll find out. Let's get this guy down first. Guy, there he is. Let's let him do one more attack. Or not. Alright. Vampiric Axe, no. Divine Blight, sure. But, uh. We're in a tricky situation here, I'll be honest. Oh, gosh. A couple of them should die from poison. Or not. Okay. Well, that's the way the cookie crumbles. All right, let's get to the boss, I think, is what I want to do. So I'll see you over there. Okay, so we're in a pretty strong position here. We have the, uh, the Hounds of Fate equipped, my beloved. We have a decent amount of health and a pretty slick and fast weapon. So, Haborim. Okay. Let's go ahead and drop the relic. I honestly don't remember what it is meant to do here. Oh, re reduces our size. So that actually means that we're less likely to get hit, uh, which is great. 
Go ahead and drop a bunch of these around here. Pick all these up. Yeah, being reduced in size is pretty, pretty nice, I'm not going to lie. Okay. Oh, yeah, that was a very powerful combination right there. I love it when everything comes together. It just, you've had a good run and, and it all, you know, everything works out just like you hope it would. Cool. Um, more... Yeah, we should probably take the food, to be honest. We're a little bit low on food right now. Unfortunately. Should I even make, like, a third farm? Is that is that worth doing? I'm not sure. Not sure. Let's see how everything is going back at the ranch. We should probably go see the fishermen here pretty soon. Just to uh, keep up with everything down there and also turn in our uh, crystals to the lighthouse. Alright, another divine inspiration. What do we want now? Outhouse 2. I don't know if we need to worry about that. Um, what does this do? Kitchen. Allow followers to cook meals for their fellow cult members. That sounds really nice. I guess as long as they have the materials, right? That means that's one less thing we have to worry about, is uh, what I would hope to be the case. Let's see. Where's the kitchen? We need a bunch of stone and a bunch of gold bars. Okay, so let's make sure we hop on that right away. Uh, yeah, stone, get that going. We need a lot of gold bars, right? There we go. Okay. Alright, we need another... I wonder if it's almost worth making a third refinery. Is that maybe right? Oh. Alex has died, unfortunately. Rest in peace. Mm, uh oh, are we out of graves? We are out of graves. That's too bad. Alright. Probably make, I don't know, three? Something like that? And, let's see. Okay, we'll go ahead and take the loot while we're at it. Okay. And it's fine. We've got some faith stuff that we'll be doing here shortly. Let's go ahead and repair this bed. We might even need to make some more uh, beds. Let's see. Put that there. And we should create a couple more. Maybe like here and here. Just since we're getting so many new people in. There we go. Give everybody a bed. Uh, and who are we bringing on board this time? Oh, I know who you are going to be. You're going to be Cassiopeia. All right. And uh, before we finish, uh, what do I want you to do? Uh, I guess do that? I don't know. Arachne's getting up there in age, it looks like. So we might want to, like, ascend her soon. Something like that. Um, Menelaus, have we given you a gift yet? Give you... Ooh, life expectancy. That's actually pretty good. Nice. Okay. 
Bellerophon, we need to give you the gift as well. There's no point in me having a whole bunch of extra um, gifts that aren't uh, doing anything, you know? So you've got one, you've got one. Jason needs one. I'll give you, yeah, moon necklace would be good, so you could stay up and refine stuff overnight. That would actually be pretty nice. And then Ajax, you get the whatever's left over. Uh, flower. There we are. Okay, and we also want to build... Okay, so let's do this. Let's go ahead and do this last crown thing together. And then I'm going to do a little bit of base maintenance uh, in between now and the next episode. And then I'll bring you back when there's something a bit more uh, of substance to worry about. All right, the corpses of dead followers may return to the earth by becoming fertilizer or unlocks the grave building. Gain two faith when followers grieve at the grieve at the grave. Sure, we'll unlock the grave. Um, I guess we may as well give ourselves more faith options. Oh, and then let's also do a sermon while we're here. Let's see if maybe we can get into the next uh, echelon of weapons. There we go. Might of the Devout. Absolutely, the new level of weapons. We want to probably max that out before anything else, right? There's one more to go. Okay. So with that, I think I will leave you uh, for now. And when we come back, we will maybe do some fishing, maybe go up against a, a new boss. But whatever it is, it will be exciting since we're doing it together. Uh, <laughs> and with that, I will see you in the next one. Thanks so much for watching.